All right, good morning everybody again. It is October 9th still. This is a second part of another video I did. If you haven't seen it, the first one, just uh, check out the description of this one. I'll throw it in. But uh, if you're new to joining us, we rented a 22 ton uh, Traco or Hi Ho or just Ho or Excavator, whatever the heck you want to call it, whatever your local slang is, <laughs> we rented one. And uh, long story short, we're gonna we're hunting some deadheads. So I already drove it, I already offloaded it, everything in the previous video, drove it over here. We have no idea what we're doing. We're learning as we go because that is just how we do it around this camp. I like to take you guys with me. And uh, remember the video where Ashton and I were, uh, I think the video title is actually Hunting Deadheads. We were out here rock picking and we were spray painting the tops of these big deadheads. Well, we found them. I knew where they were for the most part. Here's one. And over here is another one. This is a little bigger one. So there's like 30 or 35 of these deadheads in this field. We're probably gonna leave a few of them because we're gonna forget where they are, but I have a pretty good idea where they are. I just, no sense of using a Google pin or anything like that. No, no, no. We're gonna do everything the hard way around here. So let's hop in the hole and see if we can figure out what the heck we're doing here. Ah. Woo. My door closed? Yeah, it's a little chilly out there today. So I do have this, I believe this is a 60 inch clean out bucket. And we do have a digging bucket, which maybe I should be using. I probably should be using. The teeth would be a little better, They'll probably. Anyways. We're gonna pop a few. I don't think these two are too big. So. Oh. See if I can do this while talking to you guys here. Probably not. I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to literally put my, <laughs> this is like doing uh, skid steer work here. Okay, I don't want to actually dig very much dirt out. I really just want to grab that dead head if possible. Maybe right about there. Perfect. I don't want to go too deep. I don't think this one's this big. Oops, sorry about that guys, I'm trying to... Oh yeah! Alright, that's it, that's it, just pick it up, pick it up, pick it up now, Mike! I'm gonna dump the dirt back. Sorry guys, I am trying to do two things at once here. We'll just pack that back down. Grab this little rock. There it is. There it is! See if we can roll this thing in here. Beauty! Let's jump out here. All right, that's the first rock I've ever successfully rolled out with a high hole. Ow. Ow, I know why this is bent or cracked. People keep hitting their heads on these things. There's our rock. Now, I don't know what we're going to do with these. We don't actually own a rock pickery out here up on the North Farm. But that's the reason why I kept my clean out on. Because I was hoping to scoop them and grab both these rocks and take them over and dump them in those trees for now. Alright, let's try this one. Alright. Maybe I can just dig this one out with the... A little bit here. Oh, yeah, that one's not very deep. I don't want to take too much here. Just a little. All right. Oh, 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 new 
noob mistake, noob mistake. Noob mistake here. This is actually, uh... Come on, Mike, you can get this thing. Is there anybody watching me right now? Okay. Don't worry, guys. We got this. It's only painful for everybody who's witnessing this. There we go. Come on now. We got this. Ah! You know what? You know what? We got it out, right? It's got to count for something. Oh, that's two. Let's just, I don't know. Well, I thought there was three here, but. I'm gonna, Ashton's coming out with chapel here in a little bit. I'm gonna have to send her out here with my truck. She's gotta scout these things. Be a lot quicker than me. Chugga 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 my way around. I swore there was three here. Well. Maybe we'll just move off move off. We'll go hunt for some more here. Maybe I try and keep scooping these things. I don't want to waste too much time trying to scoop these things. I can always go get my father-in-law's rock picker maybe. Okay. Got it. I won't tell you how long that took me. It only took me 33 minutes. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, I, uh, I tried to uh, pop them out and then I tried to fill some of the dirt in. Not very good, I know, don't judge me on that. And then I just kept rolling it over here, rolling. I got the one, I just couldn't get the second one. Definitely helps when you can use both hands at the same time. But I had to dig a little bit to grab it. So it sucks. Don't like that. So I'm gonna just walk them over there. I might try and uh, scoop that dirt into that hole there a little bit without knocking these out. Well, I thought I was recording this whole time. I guess I wasn't. I just used the back of the bucket to kind of push the dirt in. It worked pretty good. Eventually we're going to clean up all these trees and I guess I'll deal with these rocks at that point. Wow, this is loud. Holy cow. smooth about this machine. not have a lot of track power. It definitely wouldn't be able to pull anything. It could barely pull itself up this hill. Alright, where are these things? I know they're here. We 
got to get. Oh, there's one. I see one. Should be three or four up here. This one's just a little guy. Right there. Maybe I can use my elbow on this other one. Kinda. No, I'm gonna... Can you guys see that? Nope. Okay, well, it's a little bit deeper than... Fine, I'll dig a little bit then. Here, let's just go the other way, maybe. You guys can't see the... I'll straddle and turn around. Diggits here. Oh! There it comes. Don't really want to take much dirt if I don't have to. Way too big of a bite, Mike. Way too big of a bite, buddy. It's a bigger rock than I thought it was. Did not think it was that big. Well, I'm gonna take two hands, scoop this rock, and then I'm gonna take this dirt and kick it back in here. Oh, there's still more. There's This is just a rocky, big rocky field, this one. We'll bury that. And then I need to keep looking for some more. There should be three up here. Oh, here's another one. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. There's one there. That looks like a little one. Okay guys, well, you kind of get the idea. Give me a day with this thing and we'll see if I can improve even a little bit. Let's not set the bar too high. All right. See how they stick up like that? That's that's a header smasher. All right. Maybe this one isn't very big though. We'll find out. This is where my uh, digging bucket would be better.
There it comes. I'll dump my dirt back in the hole. There we go. Come a little closer, maybe I can grab it. You guys see that okay? That right there, there's a bit of a rock. guys camera skills and digging skills I'm challenged here there it is oh, that's, that's way bigger than I thought it was So many trophies under here. So my goal is just to roll it out and push the dirt back and then try and scoop it up. Or I guess I could try scoop it up right there, but I need I need both hands. All right, I just talked to Ashton and uh, she wants to come out with the skid steer. We have that new Kubota skid steer. So she wants to come out, scoop the rocks up and then she can run them to the tree lines and then uh, she can actually level and fill up the hole, which would speed me up all heck of a lot. I'm sure you guys are already yelling at me at that, at the beginning of this video. Like, Mike, just pop them out with the excavator and just move on. So that is what we're gonna do. Will will do rock retrieving later, or maybe Ashton will, I don't know. She wants to do it, it is her field. Maybe she wants to run the high hope. Traco, high hope, excavator, way too many words. Way too many words. I could use a spotter though. The guys all have uh, Thanksgiving off, obviously, so it's just Ashton and I up here right now. Okay, I know there's rocks over there, so we should probably. as well we're also we rented at Schulte Mower I was gonna do a video of that we actually had Ernie 2.0 on for a few days I ran it for a little while and Will's run it and then we finished harvest we put the fence 724 on it so we're mowing down willows and mowing cattails and sloughs and such and such like that so this slough doesn't look like it's fully finished. Mostly because there's a little fluff of trees there. A little fluff of trees there. And this is pretty messy. Anyways, we're also harrowing. We're prototyping a, a harrow. I had to sign some NDAs. I don't even think I can say the name of the company. But anyways, so we're also harrowing mowing we're gonna do some rock digging maybe a little cleanup we got some a yard cleanup and some stuff we need to do with the hoe as well also got some work to do up in my uh, bin yard with the hoe and then we're also pro tilling we also have that blade that's on loan to us I can't remember the name of that guy's company right now dang it I apologize it's in my phone but so we're also blading, some water runs, and so on and so forth. So there's a lot of fall work going on, and we're also hauling some grain. So stay tuned, you guys. We have a lot of fun and work left to go. I'll catch you guys on the flipper. Adios, amigos.